you know, I, I was happy with uh, with the guys' mentality today. Um, you know, we asked them to focus on a couple certain different things, and uh, I think they did that uh, collectively from top to bottom. Uh, I, I was happy with the, the the way the whole team played, offensively, defensively. You know, it took us a little while to get going, but um, you know, they're they're a good team. Obviously, you know, they're gonna um, you know they're gonna do that to you. Uh, once we got our rhythm, you know, we just focused on making the next play, and um, you know, we rode that for the rest of, rest of the game. They seem to want to control the ball and maybe shorten the game, at least in the first quarter. Your thoughts on that? Yeah, that, that's uh, we, we knew that going in. You know, that was um, probably going to be uh, their game plan. And, um, you know, we were just going to have to uh, sit down and play good defense. And um, I thought our guys did a good job of, of doing that and, um, you know, not getting frustrated with the longer possessions. And, um, you know, we, uh, we we needed to do that a little bit at, at times, you know, on our end to kind of, um, you know, give the defense a break. And, you know, I thought we were, you know, so-so in terms of being intelligent with, with doing that. But, um, he, uh, you know, at the end of the day, I, you know, once we're able to get a lead, it, it makes it harder and harder for them to do that, you know, when, when you have a lead. And we just benefited uh, um, uh, once that once that happened. And it, it's nice to finally be there for us. Uh, the game wasn't about that, you know, game was just about, you know, just a uh, couple, you know, very specific things mentally that we focused on. And um, again, uh, our guys did a great job of, of focusing on those things and getting that done. Okay, let's talk about the seniors a little bit. These two kind of the founding fathers of us. Uh of Richmond Lacrosse, your thoughts on your seniors? Um, you know, this group was, uh, you know, another a very special group to us. Uh, another group that just committed to a vision. You know, there still weren't any, you know, records or results when this group committed. And, um, you know, we uh, really uh, honored that they chose to come here and play for us. You know, I thank their parents for trusting me with uh, with them for four years. Really proud of uh, the legacy that they're leaving on this program and, and the job that they've done. And, you know, I think uh, the cherry on top was Jack Worstel, uh, you know, senior who, who doesn't see a lot of playing time, you know, um, not only getting the start, but uh, scoring a goal there, you know, at, at the end of the game. So I think that just kind of uh, was a great moment for, for the whole senior class, um, you know, before the game finished. And this, of course, is not the last game for the seniors at Robin Stadium. The tournament comes up next week. Some early thoughts on the Southern Conference tournament. Uh, like like every game, you know, before it, they're all going to be really tough. Um, they're going to be a dogfight. Every everyone's going to be very competitive. So uh, we just need to get healthy here and um, or, or you know recover and and uh, and take care of ourselves and see what we can do um, in the next uh, next week here. I mean, we couldn't be more excited. It's our fourth try, I believe, against Air Force, and luckily we finally got it done on Senior Day. So, I mean, all credit to the players and the coaching staff. How sweet is it for it to be Air Force, you guys? have played them. You hadn't gotten a W until today. Yeah, it was awesome. I mean, there's no team I'd rather beat. I couldn't, I, every time I scored or the team scored, never been more amped up in my life. Jack Worcell, senior, and he had a goal to finish the day off. It was awesome. It looked like early on they just wanted to maintain possession, maybe shorten the game a little bit, forced you guys to play defense for long periods of time. Yeah, I'd agree with that. Um, we also just weren't playing well on offense. The defense kept us in the game, keeping it 0-0, zero to zero, and then we got it together in the second quarter, and then from there on out, it's okay. history. It was senior day for you. <laughs> Tell me about what this means. It's awesome. I mean, there's no. I mean, we're not done yet. We have uh, the tournament, and so this means nothing unless we win the tournament. Yeah, you know, it's a great day. Um, sending off the seniors the right way. You know, we're not done yet. We still got some unfinished business, but uh, great day for our seniors and uh, to get a win against a great team in Air Force. The Air Force, you guys have played them four or five times, but you had yet to beat them. This right. Is a long time coming. Yeah, um, you know, they knocked us out the past two years and um, we wanted to give back to our seniors who built this program and uh, paved the way for all of us, so it was good to uh, give back to those guys. All right, talk about the day. It did seem like, at least for the first quarter anyway, they were willing to just play ball control and try to shorten the game. Yeah, you know, we went to a storm look a couple of times, um, really making play faster. Um, we had a great game plan today. Coach Richards always has great game plans for us, so, you know, we executed it. Okay, and you, of course, are a senior. Uh, tell me what this means to you to get a W on Senior Day yeah. and clinch the regular season title on Senior Day. Yeah, you know, uh, gratefully we still have um, some more time with the seniors. So, uh, you know, we want to finish it off the right way, win the SOCON, and uh, make a run in the tournament. All right, look ahead to the tournament now. It's home. This will be the last year. It will be home for a while. Uh, tell me about playing here again. You know, it's great. We're, uh, I, don't, I don't think we've lost yet on our home field. We like being home. So uh, we're all really excited for it.